are Octavius and Martin Lee, which no coincidence there is the two most concerning. Though we did beat Martin in a uh, fist fight, though. He probably, if I had to say, he probably threw it on purpose just so he could make more mayhem at Raft. Okay, MJ, I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Let's hope she doesn't. Now, some that like I kind of have to bring up and I have like brought up before is that like quips because of the way this game is made. Oh. Wish me luck. And how. Okay, Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. But, uh, like, because of this being a Spider-Man game, Peter or Spider-Man, whoever we want to call him, he's going to quit, like, immediately. And, like, as my, as my head is processing the quip, and they about say it, and I literally open my mouth to say it. He already says it, so. Excuse me. Kind of sucks. The lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security. <coughs> okay then. But yeah, I mean. I don't understand why we had to clear the hmm. entire floor. It's because Sable took over building security. Routine sweep they're calling it. Checking for weapons or explosives or something. Yeah, that elevator goes through mm. its penthouse. Guess we're just gonna hear all of them. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. The residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Oh yeah? Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Mm. Ugh. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Who else can arrive? never has to vacate his apartment for security sweeps. He's got some fancy new system installed in the back security. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Hmm. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh man, I can't breathe. Let me back up. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's nearly. Hello. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. <coughs> oh yeah. But um, as I was saying, oh, it just kind of sucks that I can't let like, you know quit. Oh, now I can do stealth takedowns with her. I like this thing. So, or he's just like hurting people. Maybe concerning. Gotta turn him around. What was that? Question Good for, <laughs> for um, how Is many lures? Lovers, workman's comp. Because I I think he gave Elevator her like one. In the security room. And she just has Next like how many is convenient? Mary Jane Watson, super spy. Time to unlock hmm. that elevator. Basically, her version of Spider Cop. Alert. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Let's see if we can go through without being noticed. Yep. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Oh, oh. And Sable. Wait! Wait. Okay, why would they aim the... Why would they just aim a gun at... And it seemed like Norman was the person that saw me. Elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable. Right on cue. 
Find the alarm technician. Fire. Stupid useless button. Huh. You think she uh you think she would have been a person to double check it. Stupid useless button. You know there's another button on elevators that lets you close the door faster. Because pressing the direction or the lobby number that you want to go doesn't make it any faster. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. This looks suspicious. Please remain calm. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder if we ever get Harry on the on this like. Oh, what is this, this thing? Ooh. Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Let's see what this is. Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Interesting. Is this made out of metal? Because whenever it puts it on, it kind of does something else. So can I look at other walls? Or... Nope, just that one. That's pretty cool. Aha, uh -huh, I knew this was bids his suspicious. Son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Hmm. Oh, can I investigate? Oh, I thought I was gonna investigate a keypad. It's like these buttons look more worn out than the rest. Maybe this. This is the combat prototype from the schematic. D yes. We know that. Can I look at that? I can't. Okay. Hmm. Where, where would numbers be hidden? Aha, uh -huh, here. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? True. Okay. MJ, oh. stable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Yeah. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active <coughs> part of it. Because this is what leads to Green Goblin. As I've said. <coughs> Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Okay, numbers. Numbers, numbers. Where would numbers be hidden? Oh, wait. Would the combination be like date he let? Oh, what's that? See, it's scratched it out. See, I can't can't do anything with it. All right. Oh, where where's the combination? Some on this Looks side like a this? boatload of electrical is routed right behind that painting of Norman. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. Guess I'm just not seeing some masks. Didn't notice this. They're all the same as just color differently. Cool. <laughs> oh, I didn't see this. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. 
That must be the day Harry left for Europe. See, that's what I said. But does Mary Jane actually know that? No. Oh. Norman could be back any minute. Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Why does that matter? Unless it's the answer is in Harry's room. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. This room smells like rich people. Tch. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michael's for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but... Thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. No. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Huh. But what's this TV doing here? God. Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. So. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. Worse compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Emily, I've never heard of Harry's sister. Harry's room. But it's locked. Yeah. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. What's this? Happy birthday, dear. Sorry, I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. I've put Harry... I've sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, M. Wait, what? I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail, Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, M. I know you keep it safe. Wait. Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. That's what were you hiding wrong. from us, Harry? The key is with you, in. Yeah. Maybe this is the Green Goblin thing I was talking about. What's this? Emily's terminal diagnosis. I know Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Oh. Did Harry ever get tested? I just realized that it was the sister. It, they were just talking about the wife and mom. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Yeah, I don't know either. I think he just said, I think Otto just said Norman's Harry's greed. Mom Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Yeah, we never really Score. seen him. Um... Harry's room. Oh, I turned away for a second. I thought she was going to say more. Um, uh, What I was going to say was that uh, we never really hear uh, Harry's mother. Kind of like in Dragon Ball Z, you never hear how Hercule or Mr. Sane, whatever you want to call him, got Fidel. Like, I assume it's like that woman that's on the, like that three-person team, this like her entourage. Harry, can it? 
Oh. He is sick. I, I thought the shot thing was a bit... a bit suspicious. Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Not to worry. Maybe that's why the research... Now I really want to Robux. do the research station. Harry wants to be an environmental research attorney. Research stations. Like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. In for quote Europe. Oh, okay. <coughs> Just gonna win the whistle a bit. Leaving for Europe today, hot. Not sure how this is going to go. Dad says there's no risk, but that's Dad. Mr. M um, Doc. But that's that. Doctor Michaels thinks it's more like fifty-fifty. So okay, I might not make it. That happens. I bet you'll be reading this, Dad. Who am I kidding? You're probably reading it anyway. Norman always has to know. So if you are reading this, Dad, and if no risk at all turns out to be another Osborne campaign promise, then do me a favor. Show this next part to Pete and MJ. Just them. Please. Thanks, Dad. Love you. Man, they really are close in this. Um, version. To Peter, Parker, and Mary Jane Watson. Guys, I'm sorry, really sorry. If you're reading this, man, this is tough. Even in an imagined hypothetical letter to you, it's hard to be honest. Here goes. I'm sick. Like, really sick. Doctors think it's the same thing mom had. Neurodegeneration. Rapid onset. I've known for a while, but thought I could manage it. I didn't tell you because, well, because I didn't tell you. I was worried how you react, and I couldn't stand to see you go through what I did with mom. Watch her suffer, knowing I couldn't help. Watching her die was worse than the dying. Things got really bad recently, all those times that I was wiped out from partying, partying, or just super busy, not partying, not busy, sick. This Europe trip, well it's a cover. I'm going in for treatment, experimental, long term. Dad's been working on it forever. Promises it'll work. He hates the nickname the text have for it. The text have for it. Devil's Breath. <coughs> okay, so... Oh, okay, now I see. It's I think it's less of the, of the Green Goblin thing and more of Devil's Breath was really just made for the illness thing. Oh, man, they've really been spoon-feeding us the little hints to how the story has gone. And I haven't seen it. Alright, says it makes some good seem scary, but maybe devil's breath is what I need. A little bit of bad to do a lot of good. Okay, dad's here. Time to go. Dang. Oh! Was I reading for too long? I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here! The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. It's about the painting Keep Team Two on standby. I'm getting some air. Andrew's got a thick accent. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Continuing fleet. The hell was that? Not me, not an intruder. If that's what you're thinking. Oh, I probably should have taken him out. Maybe it'd be best if I didn't do that, though. Because then maybe they, uh... Control. We're all clear. I could be in more trouble than I thought. Oh, this guy I might. You don't see me at all. Oh, God. Yep, that's what I was thinking. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. 
Okay, July 18. Come on, Bingo. game. Just let me do it. No, oh, no! Dang! <coughs> I thought I'd do something like whenever I went to Standish. Okay. Guess what? You ain't getting one. Better check it out. Cancel that control. Sector clear. Or is it? Better check it out. Yeah, that's probably a very bad idea. No, you don't. No. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, no, don't. Just leave me alone. Leave me alone. I don't see nobody. No, see? Uh, uh, noise. There's noise there. See, you don't. Nothing. Nothing's going on, man. Nothing. See? Never mind. It was nothing. Yeah. See. Like I told you. Okay, July 18. Bingo. Go, go. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, what's in Super here? Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Hey, Something all those spiders. Something in this room must be useful. This. Norman Osborne, GR27 Research Log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR27 is a cure. Not a disease. <coughs> but try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little yeah. more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure. Yeah. I almost can't believe it. We knew that. Pete said it could cure any kind of disorder. Okay, before we look at that, we hear bubbling noises. What's what this? are these things? Yeah. Prototype hand grenades? Oh. Oh, my mind just clicked it together. Remember I was talking about Green Goblin stuff? What do those look like? Pumpkin bombs. Okay, what do I look- uh, let's look at this thing. Norman's got a real mad scientist thing going on. You're telling me there's not something in there? Wow. Okay. Norman oh. wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. There's four of them. Okay. VIPs. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. Kind of makes sense, though. Michael's is the lead on Devil's Breath. Yeah. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Defense? I had no idea they owned so much of New York. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Yeah. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building, but there's no security detail. There's one right this there. This can't be it. Nope. That's just a sable patrol. Um, when I'm looking at it. Oh, I didn't even know this. That I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. He visited this one, he visited this one. Okay, if it's going through the route of all these buildings, there's only these, right? Oscorp Where's the thing went here? But no Michaels or Sable. That's not it. Wait, I don't understand. Okay, I'm trying to look at where these three things kind of collide. This looks like it. Except it looks, I guess he doesn't. Where do these three categories overlap? Yeah. That must be the lab's location. 
Here? I don't think I've chosen the right categories. Wait, what? Commercial buildings. Oh! I didn't know that. That's wow. what I was doing. So many records facilities. Oscorp's going all. No. Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti serum. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath Lab. Yeah, how about this? If I can even look at it. Can I? There. Hmm. Looks wrong. Oh, come on. This? Nice. Got some overlap with Dr. Michael's path. Oscorp's going on. No. Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti serum in a, a records facility. Oh. Bravo, bravo, bravo. Oh, I did know I could do that with all of them. GR27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that. I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. Martin Lee incident? Hmm. Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. No, I he... We'll be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. He didn't give him his powers, did he? <sighs> he did. Fuck you. As a kid? That's why he hates all. Let me guess, he does something to. Wait, was that Octavius? I didn't. I, I didn't look. This is why he hates. Oh, it is. Oh my god. Norman and Otto. They started all this. They created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Oh. Yeah, I would have been scared to. Who's there? That thing was looking straight at you. Don't worry, you. Don't worry, MJ, you're just jumpy. Stun gun will not work on her. <gasps> mm, my my controller vibrating. We have a breach. High alert. MJ, think about it. If Norman replicated Spider Man. You could be Spider Woman. Okay then. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Sector clear. Continuing patrol. Control, I are you kidding me? That was right there, are you kidding me? <coughs> I thought I threw it farther, or aimed it farther. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Got a partial visual. Moving to confirm. Are you kidding me? No? Oh, that's right, at the plant. Hey! Wait. Yes, I wanted to be caught, game. Yes, I did. Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. That guy's just not gonna move. Man, that's like a big, big thing. Why did I have to say like that's like a big thing to like kind of uncover, you know? I was kind of wondering how Martin Lee got all that, all of his powers, you know? Oh, that, no, he doesn't hear it. Man down! Man down! No. 
I'm just gonna pass through. Don't worry about me. I am a okay. Guess I gotta take this guy out. Or not. Keep searching. We know he's here. Don't be too sure about that. The hell was that? The hell was that? Think I'm on a roll. Need to clear that balcony. Good night. Oh, you just had to fall in your gun. No. Pete, you here? Turn it off, Lex. Now. Are you okay? We'll be in a few seconds. Northwest corner. You guys didn't think about doing that sooner. There we go. You are crazy. You're amazing. <laughs> yep, amazing Spider Man. You know, not like I've been called that before. But dang. I was kind of wondering what Martin Lee, like, you know, head of the Feast Center, had some kind of hate towards Norman for. Mm -mm. Don't worry, I just love it up. It's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. That would also explain the partnership. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... You find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner. No. Pretty sure if I had Sue with the eyes thing, he'd be he would have been squinting. Oh no. Forty two. They painted things on them? Are we gonna have a spire woman? Cause that would be nice. Oh, it's like, well, this hasn't- I'm just gonna get comfortable.